a half an hour later, it's a little bit heavier with regard to fatigue. You start to feel that a little bit of a heavy fatigue feeling. And I'm gonna see how long it is before I wind up crashing. <laughs> What's up, YouTubers? This is Lawrence Ryan here, coming to you live once again from the tunnel. In this episode, I'm going to show the video of my experience and reaction to the second COVID-19 vaccine shot. You know, I have fun with these reaction videos, just my own personal experience, not meant to diminish anybody else's, but also not meant to diminish the importance of the vaccines themselves. As of this recording, Pfizer has received full FDA approval for their vaccine. Moderna TX, the company that makes the Moderna vaccine, submitted their BLA, Biologics Licensing Application, to the FDA in June, and they're expected to receive full approval by the end of the year. J&J, Johnson & Johnson, is scheduled to make their BLA submission by the end of the year as well. So this news seems to be creating confidence in those people who are on the fence about the safety of the vaccines, myself included. Um, I didn't get vaccinated right away. Uh, the only reason I got vaccinated when I did was because it was a requirement to be able to see somebody who wasn't well. But I do think we are seeing improved uh, confidence. So USA Today said that between 60 and 70 percent of Americans have received at least one vaccine shot. And the New York Times puts that number at closer to 75 percent. Now, the Delta variant is still wreaking havoc with the unvaccinated populations as we speak. But hopefully this newfound confidence We'll get people out there and vaccinated and we can slow the spread of this thing. All right. That said, on with the video. But before that, please don't forget to like and subscribe and or follow. Hit that bell for notifications so you get informed when the new videos and premieres are coming. And leave me a comment down below. Right down there. Actually, what is down there? Heading out to get the second shot of the Moderna vaccine. And uh, yeah, this time I know what to expect. All right, I'm here again, time to mask up. Hopefully second verse, same as the first. Hello. How are you today? Good, how are you? Good, I'm here to get my second Moderna vaccine shot. One o'clock, last name Ryan. And the first name? Lawrence. Great, you just fill that out. And um, there's a back to both pages and sign and then you can bring it up to the register when you're done and Rachel will be giving you your shot today. Okay, thank you. You're welcome. This time I gotta fill out paperwork, not sure why. Gotta do that. There's a lot of information about whether or not I have had an allergic reaction. What's strange is I didn't have to fill this out the first time. This is a consent form and all this other stuff. I just came in last time and got the shot. So now I have to wait another 15 minutes, make sure there's no reaction. Feeling good so far. I just got yelled at for going to get a water. One pharmacy call. They yelled at me for getting the water. I just got it out of my car. They were overall very nice though. I think it's all just a matter of trying to make sure everybody's safe. Okay, so about 10 minutes after I got the second shot, I was a little bit lightheaded, just a little bit. 
I went out to get some water to the car and came back and they yelled at me for leaving. I was supposed to stay in the seat. Sorry about that. Wanted to get some water. Uh, still a little bit lightheaded, but I think it's because uh, I need some food. So I'm going to grab some lunch and then we'll see what, uh, see how I feel after that. So lunchtime. Okay, so I've had some lunch and it's about a half an hour or so after the injection. <clears throat> and felt a little bit of that same kind of like, as I mentioned before, that sort of like two shot euphoria of tequila or whiskey or something. A little bit of euphoria. But now a half an hour later, it's a little bit heavier with regard to fatigue. You start to feel that a little bit of a heavy fatigue feeling. And I'm gonna see how long it is before I wind up crashing. Okay, so I didn't pass out this time. I am slightly fatigued, a little bit lethargic, but besides that, no problem. Let's see what happens the rest of the day, though. That's the sound I've been making for the last two days. It's the second day after the second COVID-19 Moderna vaccination shot. And as you saw the first day, just felt a little funky. The next day, which was Thursday, I woke up at 2.30 in the morning, soreness on the injection site, which I still have the band-aid here, still a little bit sore, soreness and a little achy, but as the day went on, everything hurt. Every joint, every muscle, my eyelashes hurt. Everything hurt. It was like you fell asleep in a clothes dryer and somebody turned it on high and you come out like really warm and just like beat up all over. So today, a little more of the same, but it's starting to subside a little bit. The whole thing, oh, by the way, all that's happening while you have this kind of like euphoria going on. So, you know, yesterday I was just dumb. I couldn't try to do anything that required any focus whatsoever. I just was like completely out of it. Today, I have a little bit of it back, thankfully. Anyway, I guess you could say if you had no side effects whatsoever, that would mean that perhaps your body was not building those antibodies. So the fact that you are having the side effects and the reactions to the spike protein in the vaccination, that means that you're building an immunity, which in the long run is a very good thing. And hopefully that will help the whole world and we can be rid of this scourge forever. Anyway, I'm going to go to bed. This is Lawrence Ryan signing off for the Rebel Tunnel. Be safe, and I'll see you on the other side.